For these vlogs, English subtitles are available. Just click on the subtitles icon at the bottom of the screen. Les sous-titres en français sont disponibles pour ces vlogs. Il suffit de cliquer sur l'icône des sous-titres en bas de l'écran. Do serii tych vlogów dostępne są polskie napisy. Wystarczy kliknąć na ikonkę napisy, która znajduje się na dole ekranu. The gear, the gear for the video is actually four to five basic things. The camera body, Sony Alpha 6500, the Sigma lens and 18 to 35 mm, the camera GoPro Hero 3, the gimbal Feutech G5, and the last thing is the cheapest tripod. And I finished the video before the music was done, and the only thing about that was that after the whole production the music was so ambient, so epic that I needed to change the video format from full HD to panorama view. And except the first, the first frame that was actually way better in the old resolution, the whole video is best in the panorama view. In the video I wanted to recreate this mood of childhood and growing up and that is why the inspiration for the video was Hans Christian Andersen's fairy tales. I will just mention the obvious ones, which are the ugly duckling and the white swans. But my favorite one and the least obvious is the teapot. So the teapot is this story told from the viewpoint of the teapot. And first the teapot is this beautiful object made of porcelain, but after that it's broken it and it becomes a flower pot and he learns about relationship, love and devotion but at the end it's completely broken and it's thrown away into the yard, useless. So in the video, since I was the only actor, I wanted to recreate this object point of view storytelling and I've asked my friend Viola to craft this poncho and I wanted to have the poncho as the first object in the first frame and the last object in the last frame. On the shooting day the weather was perfect. The day was a little bit cloudy and windy so we had this right amount of movement in the frame and the light was soft and diffuse because we've been using only the natural light for all the shooting. So the, sh the, the weather was perfect for shooting, not so perfect for swimming because the water was freezing cold and the most difficult scene was when I needed to go under the water and not one single time, but multiple times. So I needed to go out, dry myself, dry my hair out, go back into the water, freezing cold, set the camera, freezing cold, go under the water for about three or four seconds. And once again, go out, dry myself, repeat and repeat and repeat. And the worst thing was that in, at the end of the shooting day, I didn't have the perfect frame for this scene. But I said, hey, good is enough, enough is enough. And it, at the end, the scene is okay, it's fine. It's not perfect like I imagine, but it's okay. Thank you for watching. If you are interested in independent music, songwriting and music video making, I will put some links in the description to videos that I found inspiring. So you should definitely check them out. Please subscribe to my channel and hit that bell button in order to be notified about new content. Rendezvous tonight. Rendezvous tonight.